how to install Codex CLI in VS Code. So as you can see, I have Codex installed. And over here, I have the option to come and select the model that I want, either agent or chat. And then I can simply come in and chat with Codex and click on Submit. And that is it. So let me show you how you can get it in your VS Code. Okay, so first you have to open the VS Code. And then over here, where we have the sidebar, okay, come and then click on the extension okay so when you click on it it is going to open the search and then over here where you have the search come and then search for open ai codes okay so it will come the codes open ai will come okay then come and select the official one you see that we have the install and then we have the down arrow come and then click on the down arrow you have two ways we have install release version and then install pre release version come and then select install release version and then click on the it okay so when you click on it it is then going to ask you if you try it yes just come and then click on trust publisher and install and over here as you can see it is installing just allow it to finish installing and it has finished installing okay so the next thing that you have to do is that you have to come and then sign in with your chat gpt account and then you have to be on any of this plan it is very important before you'll be able to use it okay so then let's go and then sign in with our account over here you can simply come and then put the mouse on this okay and then you will see that we have the settings icon here you can come and then click on it or you can simply come here and then come and then click on the codes icon from this option okay so when you click on it it is going to open the codes tab just like this okay and then over here you have the option to come and then sign in with church apt so come and then click on sign in with church GPT. It is then going to ask you to open a, a website that with your browser. Click on open. It's going to bring you right here. And over here, come and then put in your email address and then you can come and then click on continue. You also have the option to come and then click on continue with Google. That one is easy and fast. And then over here, it is going to sign in. Okay. And then come and click on continue. After that, that is it you have signed in to code cli okay all that you have to do is simply close the page okay so after closing it you'll be able to see it right here so come and then close this and after closing it over here you see that we have the sidebar you can drag it back or forth and then fix it okay and then over here come and click on next after clicking on next come and then click on next again okay and after that over here this one will come and then simply come and then click on next again and then simply come and then click on next okay and that is it okay so but before you be able to use the codes you have to open it in a folder okay so any folder that you want to work in simply come to the file and then simply come here to where we have open folder come and click on it and come and select the exact folder and after that come and click on select folder and that is it you can simply come and then select the folder that you want to work with okay so this is what i want to work with and after that simply come and then click on the codex icon and it is going to open the tab just like this you can simply come and then select the one that you want either chat or agent and then you can simply come and then start chatting with code cli right in vs code so like the video and then see you in my next video